Hey guys, Justin here from Small World Gaming, uh, here with Will again, getting ready to do a uh, second game in our campaign. Uh, we are fighting each other again, we're both using the same army, so I apologize for that. Uh, however, our my at least my kill team has changed up a lot, because I thought the last one sucked. Um, that was a part, partly due to my dice, those nicely balanced casino dice are not conducive to rolling <laughs> sixes, so no. uh, I needed dice that rolled a few more sixes. Well, it's made for um, casinos. Yeah, that's true. So um, we're gonna we're gonna be playing. We we did decide to switch up the terrain quite a bit. So we're fighting more like on the outskirts of the city now. Uh, we've got a few trees and a little hill. I'm still playing on the same board just because it's nice to get the right size for yeah. the game. Um, what do you think is gonna happen? Um, are you bringing the same kill team? Um, I'm going exactly the same. I figure I it worked before, kind of. Um, Hopefully, get some more rules yeah. right this time. Yeah, <laughs> we we kind of messed up a few things in that last battle. So, it's a battle report. Yeah, it's a battle report. Sure. All right. So yeah, no, I'm I'm optimistic. I'm a little scared of your melee. Yeah, I, I so I decided to go a little bit more melee heavy on this list. I don't actually know what mission we're playing yet. We haven't rolled. Yeah. Um, but uh, hopefully it's not the one where you sit back and shoot. So <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm all for that. Uh, yeah. If it is, oh well, we'll, we'll I'll just have to run up and Maybe kill. A sniper things. will work. So I do have a sniper still. So mm -hmm. all right. Well, we're gonna go over. I'm gonna go over my kill team, and then we'll go over uh, Will's, and we'll get the game started. All right, guys, uh, Justin here. This is the kill team that I have decided to bring today. <laughs> so I'm still running Skitari. I've still got the same leader, which is going to be this here um, infiltrator with the taser goat and flechette blaster. Uh, but what I've taken out, because a couple of my guys died last time, <laughs> I've decided to put in three rust stalkers, and I've given them all um, just two transonic blades. So I did make a couple of these guys specialists, so... That guy right there and that guy right there are going to be combat specialists. Um, I did still bring my sniper, uh, but in addition to that, I just have one fire team of uh, three rangers. No upgrades or anything like that, just a, just a regular fire team. So I'm hoping that uh, with a little bit more close combat, a little bit better movement, more guys that have multi-wounds, that I'll be able to survive the uh, the side bolts and the, and the other things that he's got coming at me. So let's go ahead and look at uh, Will's army. What did you decide to bring today? All right. Well, I kept it kept it pretty much the same here. I kept it with uh, the leader here. That's your sorcerer. sorcerer. Okay. And then I got the what was it? Demol Demolition specialist. Yep. With the icon of flame and warp flamer. Okay. Got the heavy gunner with the soul reaper cannon. Yep. Um, a regular and then rubric. The regular rubric with okay. inferno. And then, Three of course, following it up with these Angors. And he's still a the comms, comms, yeah. comms specialist. Okay. Yeah. So bringing the same exact thing as last time, um, hopefully I will do a little bit better. Uh, we're going to go ahead and roll for mission and set up our deployment and go from there. All right, guys. So we went ahead and laid out the battlefield, decided to change it up a little bit for this game. Um, now, we did go ahead and roll our mission for the, um, for the campaign second battle, and we got Sweep and Clear, which is a matched play mission. Uh, essentially, what you need to do in this is... You either kill or break the opposing team. If you don't, at the end of the game, uh, every objective that you control, those four spots marked there, uh, you get three victory points for. And then every enemy um, uh, enemy that you take out of action, any mo model, you get one victory point for. So that's essentially what we're trying to do now. Um, at this point, we are, are going to go ahead and start with our scouting phase. So we've each picked one, and we are going to put our dice down at the same time. So I picked three. Uh, three is disarm traps. Okay, which is the counter to two, I do believe. You yep. place traps. So I won't get to do anything because I think he picked six, which is eliminate sentries. Which he won't get to do anything nope. either. So because I didn't get to to move any sentries this time. So kind of hoping you'd rush up with your melee then. <laughs> All right, so you can do that. All right, so we get to go ahead and roll off for our deployment now. I got double sixes. Yeah. All right, these dice are obviously to a, off to a better start already. <laughs> so I get to choose my corners. deployment. It's going to be one of these corners. Once again, this one's kind of like search and destroy, um, but with a five-inch bubble. So uh, for simplicity's sake, I think I'm just going to go ahead and take this corner here um, because my army kind of wants to be moving anyways. So, um, uh, And we're going to go ahead and start... Uh, laying out our deployment. So we know one dice is going to be on the objective. Yeah. And the other one there. And there. Yep, that 
that'll be me, pretty much. So that's going to be my corner right there. Now, because uh, I won this roll, he gets to place the first model. All right. Putting down his Soul Reaper cannon. Rookie move at best. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> Um, so I need, I need my sniper to have, like, good lines of fire, and there's not a lot, to be honest. So he's gonna go right there. Now, I do believe to control these objectives, you have to be within two inches? Yep, two inches. Okay. Alright, we go... Okay. Just regular Zangor. Yep. I'm going to put a regular Rust Stalker right there. Don't think you'll be able to go quite that far because it, it'll be the edge oh, of yeah, the line. Oh, yeah, the edge right there. Mm -hmm. okay. okay. I'll put my leader. He's going to go right behind here. Got my leader coming up over here. Okay. I'll do another rust stalker. And we got the comm specialist going right behind the sand. Sure. Uh, another rust stalker. <laughs> right there. You have an eight inch moving on the rust mm -hmm. stalkers? You have eight inches, two wounds, three attacks. Or two attacks, sorry. The Princeps guy has three. All right. But I'll stick him right here. Okay. I'll go ahead and put a Ranger down right there. He's right there. His sniper's right there. Ah, trying to hide from that sniper. <laughs> Pull him right here. You won't be able to hide. And then that's your last model? Yep, that'd okay. be my last drop. So I'm going to put two rangers on the line right there. All right, so that is going to con conclude our deployment. So we can go ahead and pick up our markers here. And the next thing will be to um, go ahead and roll for priority, I do believe. Yep. And then I think we messed it up last game. I do believe we actually only get two command points to start with, uh, not three at the beginning of the game. So, but they do accumulate. Yeah. All right, guys, we are going to go ahead and roll for initiative. See who gets to move first in this game. Oh, I seven. might. You got a seven. I got a seven as well. Ooh. So we're going to roll off again. I got a five this time. Six. And he got a six. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so it looks like he's going to have initiative on the move. So go ahead, Will. Start your movement right. phase. Well, we're gonna start off with where's the you got some of the markers over there? Oh, I got some over here. Yeah, there's a whole pile of markers here. All right, well we're gonna ready him up. Uh, let me check. Yep. Okay, he will be ready up. He's within 12, 24. Yeah. Um, oh, and then I'm picking shroud Som for my uh, uh, mechanical thing. Yeah, jigger. Mm -hmm. What's that do? You're an additional minus one to hit me. Uh, okay, flame <laughs> do some work. Um, you can certainly try. Six. Nine inches. Need an eight. Oh. As long as I'm obscured, you're an additional minus one to hit me. Okay. And I get if I'm not obscured, then it doesn't plus matter. Plus one to hit, but it doesn't matter with him. Yeah. Or plus one to my wounds if you're obscured. Okay. With him. For uh, demolition specialist. Okay. So you moved. We'll go see if the charge is optimal. It's a 10. Yep. I would need a 9 with the bay horn right behind me. Um, yeah, we'll go ahead and charge this thing, or Into the rest locker? Into both of them. Okay. Alright. It is a no. six, my friend. 
Needed a nine. Still move six, though. Yep. Would I still move plus one for my Bayhorn? Um, yeah. Because it gives me plus so. one. Plus one to your charge. Charge and right? advance. Yeah. So seven. Getting right in front of me, huh? We're just going to tuck right in there. Okay. Uh, we're just going to regularly move him over here. And they're not even going to pop their... Okay, they can't see him, but those guys can. That's fine. All right, Rubric, you are going to advance. Not very far. So seven inches. Uh, Reaper auto cannon. What can you see? You said you have a negative one to hit if you're obscured. An additional. Additional, so it'd be negative, negative two. two to hit me. Yeah. So I gotta hit what's in the open. That's how I was kind of hoping I would go though. first. Yeah. <laughs> I, I see how you deployed right there up front. Yeah. <laughs> Um, the only one out in the open is that one Ross, that uh, Russ Stalker, or whatever that is right here. Yeah. That's my one that's not a specialist. Gotcha. Ah, it'd be better if it was. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, everything else is obscured. All right, um, he's going to ready up as well. Okay. Where is, there it is. And then the Sorcerer, he can move six. Uh, so he'd move three that way. even have to. Can you see the other guy? Is he a specialist? Yes. So the technically specialist the dude would be closer. Specialist, yeah. Um, yeah, the sorcerer's not going to move. He's just going to do his damage from afar. Okay. All right, let me just double check that. Get in there. Okay, yeah. He's within 12 to shell. Probably go for him as well. All right, that is my movement. Okay. On you. Yeah, all on me. All right, so I think you've made a critical mistake, my friend. Probably. <laughs> this guy's going to charge. <laughs> you have any guns? Uh, nope. All right. I think a 12 will do it. All right. And as my react, I will choose to retreat. Uh, so that, that allows you to move three inches before I move. Is it before you move? Yeah. All right, so you'd still get your I, 12. With a 12, I'm definitely getting right. you. Well, I still will move back three. Okay. We'll go over here. Yeah, I'm still yep. going to ah, climb over with my extra movement. All right. Um, this guy is going to attempt to charge him. Okay. Um, let me see. If that's going to help me. You know what? No, he's not. No, he's not. <laughs> he's going to move right Oh, there. Okay. Yeah. This guy will attempt to charge him since you can't see me. Mm -hmm. An eight. Am I within nine? I am definitely within nine. And I will choose to react with him. Oh, so move back three? Yeah. yeah. Perfect. I'm assuming that was less than three. Correct. So um, the problem here is that I think that would bring me out. I wouldn't complete the charge move at that point. Mm -hmm. So um, I might do something different with him then. Because you do it before I yeah. move. So um, yeah, I'm going to have to do something different. I'm going to have to move. You can still move the eight. I can, yeah. I think I'm just going to stay over here though. <laughs> so this guy is going to charge. Uh, Ooh, eight. Halfway in there. We'll certainly do it. Ouch. <laughs> Poor Zangor. Yeah. All right. This guy's going to move up. That guy's going to move up to there. To there. Yeah. And then my sniper is going to ready. Mm -hmm. Ah, and you can definitely see that rubric. Oh, yes. <laughs> All right. And then this guy's going to ready as well. Sorry, I know I've got some firing ones. There we go. Okay. Nope. I won't be shooting much of anything. All right. I think I've made a successful movement phase this time, <laughs> but we'll see. Yep. So, um, 
Yeah, I think that's psychic. pretty much it for the movement phase for me. So on to the psychic phase. All right. Well, he's twelve inches. He yeah, he's him? definitely the closest. I right. think. Yeah, I can't even see him. Yeah, he's gonna be visible. Pretty so. tucked away. Yeah. All right. So first, we are gonna do his icon of flame. Closest is still gonna be yeah. him on a six, right? Yep. Okay. Get that out of the way. On a six. Nope. nope. Okay. All right. On to him. He's gonna sideball him. Yep. Forty-five. Uh, Twelve Ooh. will do it. It'll perils me though. Yeah. I will take the command point. Uh, you reroll both. Oh, both. Right. Yeah. Oh, all right. Sorry. Yeah, it's a little bit different. Yeah, in this. So, uh, um, six, a nine. nine. Yeah, so that's I'll definitely gonna it. go off. Uh, does one mortal wound to yeah. him? Um, there's nothing I can do about it. So he's gonna go ahead and take his mortal wound. And that is my psychic phase. Okay. <laughs> on to shooting. Yep, on to shooting. Um, and I think I'm actually gonna go ahead and spend two command points here. And intervene with one of my ready models. Okay. Yep. Now use that one. Yep. So my sniper is going to go ahead and shoot. Okay. Um, the question I have is, uh, am I with? No longer Just within eight on him, yeah. so he won't really be able to shoot anyone. So my sniper is going to take a shot at uh, your soul reaper cannon. Um, You're dead. Can, can I not see you? Nope. Oh shoot. Yeah. The only one the you only can I, see I, is. Okay. Oh, well, yeah. You could see him. Let questionably. See. Let me check on that. I don't think I can see him either. So, no. all right, I'm going to shoot your flamer. <laughs> He's in the open. Yep. I have no bu minuses here. So I'm hitting on threes, re-rolling ones for my sniper, sniper specialist. I'll, re I'll roll these dice. <laughs> <laughs> Why? <laughs> sniper. Okay. Got to pray better to the next one. Yeah, I have not recanted to the ones and zeros enough again. <laughs> All right, yeah, you're ready, see. model. He can see him for sure, but you're gonna be outside. Yeah, big one. Yep. Um, I'm probably obscured too, so um, probably. All right, so It'd be five nice. negative two. I'm definitely obscured. Yeah. All right. So so he's the only person he can shoot at. Well, he can see the trees. That might be a better option, actually. Yeah. All right, you so, would have the range penalty, but you're still negative two. Yeah, uh, right. for oh, obscured, obscured yep. and yeah. so, but I'll get the second shot. Yep. All right, so got the rubric going into the ranger. Yep, it's the ranger. So on fives. Good. No. Nothing. All right, that is him. Okay. Um, goes to my next ready model, yep. which will be this guy, and he can see your mm -hmm. soul reaper cannon, so he's gonna What's shoot. What's the range on him? Uh, 30. Yeah. So uh, I'm, I'm going to be negative 2 to hit uh, for range because I'm over 15 uh, and because you're obscured. So I'm going to be hitting on a 5. I rolled a 2 again. So that's uh, what I would like to call not a hit. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Hobby Town's not treating you right. No? Okay. <laughs> right. So my next ready is the Soul Reaper Cannon. Who can't see? The only person he would be able to see is Probably the same the person. Same guy. Yeah. I only have a 24 inch range. Oh, yeah. still enough. Yeah, but once again, minus three to hit me. Obscured, Shroud Psalm, and um, so on sixes. Yeah, on sixes. All right, let's see what we got. Of course, you still get one. one. The rest were ones. Yep. Uh, let me see on my heavy specialist to see if he did anything real quick. I don't know what the. Um, he's a demo. No, it just suffers my he negative one to hit. Yeah. So. And uh, demo does uh, the wound roll plus yeah. one. Okay. All right, so one, strength five, two, toughness, three. three. So on threes. That's a wound. Negative three. Of course. <laughs> so I have a six up bionic save. Oh, it was almost a six. That will not do it. So I'm going to take a wound. Um, Did they only have one? Yeah, they only have one. All right, so, so let's see if it's a flesh wound. For the neg, what for the penalty? Yeah, so I'm I'm obscured, so it's gonna be minus one. So, so whereas normally the four would have killed me, it does not kill me this so time. So flesh wound. So I take a flesh wound, and I'll use um, a different dice for the. F I'll use a red dice for flesh okay. wound. Yeah. Uh, that is his shot. Okay. I don't have any other ready models, so if you do, so it just goes to me for the initiative for shooting. Yeah. But unfortunately, some more dice here. Ah. I could still flame that guy. No! <laughs> Alright. D6. 
auto hits. Two, and I already re-rolled this turn. Yep. All right, so um, I get a plus one to my wounds if the target is obscured for um, demolition dem demolition specialist. Okay. I think that's what he's called. Yeah. All right, so this would be threes, strength four, T so on twos. Twos, yeah, with your plus one. So of course, one, I still get one. Yeah, and negative AP. two. So I was still looking for that six up, which I rolled a two again. So <laughs> And you get the obscure thing, so on a five up, yep. he goes away. That's a four. So no flush wound on that guy. Or the front guy, sir. I believe that is all my shooting, because he just has a six-inch flamer pistol. Sure. Uh, so I've got a few more shooters. Um, this guy charged, or attempted a charge, so he will not be able to shoot. Those two are in close combat. They don't have guns either way. Uh, however, these two are pretty much in good shape. So we're going to shoot with this guy here. Um, he's just going to be minus one because my own guy's obscuring him, but he's going to shoot that flamer dude. Sounds good. So hitting on fours. That looks like two hits to me. Yep. They're strength four, so I'm going to be wounding on fours. And then sixes are AP minus one. That is one wound, my friend. Uh, no AP. Damage one damage. Yep. So two up. Okay, he's good. All is dust. And then this guy's going to do the same thing. Why the prejudice against my flamer? Yeah. All right. That is two hits. Ooh, one with a... Oh, no, that's on the wound roll, right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. There it is. There it is. One AP minus one. Looking All for right. a three up, then. So three up. <laughs> Makes All it either dust. way. Of course. <laughs> uh, though saving throw also counts for my invulnerable as well. Yep. Yeah. Okay. So those two over here have already shot. Mm -hmm. These two have shot... He attempted to charge. Does he have anything? No guns. Okay. So that is going to be all my shooting for the turn as well. All right. So uh, I do believe we're going to go to the combat phase. Scarily enough. Yep. So I've got two guys in combat that both charged. So I do get to uh, go first because mm -hmm. he's only got one command point, I do believe. Yep. So he won't be able to intervene. So we'll go ahead and uh, attack with my combat specialist. Uh, that gives him plus one attack. Yep. So he's got three attacks hidden on threes. Okay. All right, cool. <laughs> I hit once. Right. Um, this is, these are strength plus one because I've got the two transonic blades. Um, and four. Yep. Yeah, uh, so I'm going to need a four to wound you because I'm strength three base. Okay. I think. But that is a wound. All right. AP? Um, I don't know if they actually have any AP on these. I actually, I don't think it matters for my birds. Yeah. Five I haven't up actually vulnerable. used these before. All right. Let me just double check real quick. Yeah, I have an invulnerable either way. Sure. All right, five up. No. Nope, there's no AP on these, just plus one strength. Yeah, so, nah, I went through. Yeah, so you are not obscured. No. Nope. So it's going to be a four up to kill you. That is a six, my friend. There you go. Yeah. Bird is gone. Yes. Uh, and then he'll go ahead and pile in his three, and then he'll make a consolidation move with three as well and get within an inch of that guy. And then you can fight me back, because I'm within an inch of you. <laughs> I think you've got one attack. Yeah, I Just so. no AP or anything. Yep. <laughs> Alright, three up. That's yeah. a hit. T3. Three. It's no. not a wound. So. Yeah. Alright, I would call that a successful um, fight phase, because I got a victory point. <laughs> Woo! And I'll uh, count my victory points on one of my now banished casino dice. dice. Casino dice. All right, I'm up to one victory point. Anything else? Morale uh, phase. I've got a couple guys. I've got three guys or two guys with flesh wounds. So yeah, I don't have any morale. Yeah. So um, I don't think I can fail my morale though, because obviously this guy's got a guy next to him. Mm -hmm. well, this I guy's have... leadership six, and there's no one out. Of combat. Six. Yeah. Doesn't he still take one from uh, the flesh wound, though? No, the flesh wound doesn't add any. It's people that are out of action. Okay. Yeah. The flesh wound just is to, get yeah, to determine who needs yep. to take one and if uh, your team has broken or not. Yep. So. What about the rest of Uh He did not take a flesh wound. He's just taken a regular wound. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Yep. Right. So he is still good to go. Right. On to turn two. Looks like it. All right. Roll off for the initiative. Yeah. I got a six and something in the trees. I got a four, four. so ten total. 
Yeah, you. that gives you the initiative once again. All right. Damn um, it. <laughs> get the command points going up, so now I got three. Yep, I'm back up to two. All right, what we got going on here? So I need to get you up. You're obscured. And that'll still work, kind of. I am going to charge this Angor into him. Okay. Uh, I'm going to actually multi-charge this Angor into both those guys. I have no guns. Yeah. Plus I'm in uh, combat. I get a plus one for being close to comms. Yep. Which is good. Yeah, uh, seven. Seven. That got that'll get off. you around, yeah. though. So. Yeah, that'll tie him in. Um, <laughs> cool. So within one inch there. Yep. Um, you are going to fall back. Here. He's retreating. Yep. Okay, cool. He'll still be able to see that guy in case you want to charge over here. This guy here? Yep. Okay. Perfect. Um, you can't overwatch, so. Oh, uh, yeah. Yep. Didn't Remember, even you can't make a that. reaction if you retreat. Hmm. Then I'm just going to slightly nudge him back this way. Sure. I totally forgot about that. Um, so you, Rubric, are kind of doing your job by staying still, but... Yeah, no. We'll ready him up. Okay. Give him a sh shot, maybe. Yep. Um, Soul Reaper Cannon. Where do you want to go at? Still really can't see anyone to shoot. And you're tucked in right there. Uh, that sniper. So just, just remember, gonna... you could have deployed all behind this rock. I totally could have. <laughs> yeah. I thought about that, but then I like can't exit out here because yeah. there's air, so I can only exit out there. Yeah, I would have given it to you, but that's fine. I thought about that after yeah. we were like placing yeah. it down. I was like, eh, whatever. Um, so we're just gonna move him up a little bit. Go right there. Sorcerer just wants to peek around the corner a little bit so he can see something. Sure. Um, and we can call that good for now. Okay. So I got one ready. You charged, did your thing. You didn't move and do anything. So we are actually going to charge him into both as well. Okay. Um, since he's the comm specialist, he gets his plus one to charge. Not sure what I need, but we got an eight, which becomes a seven. Or a nine. Oh, wow. Yeah. <laughs> Floridians don't know math. All right, but we're definitely in there. Okay. We can come say hi. We'll see whose melee stands up. Yeah. All right, that is officially my movement. Okay. So, on to you. As uh, predicted, this guy will... Ready? Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I see that. This guy here with the flesh wound is going to move over a little bit to there. Oh, I have to pick a new canical. I'll do reroll ones to hit and okay. shoot in, in the fighting phase. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> All right. Um, this guy that's got the flesh wound, he's going to move back to here. Aww. Yeah. He didn't want to play. I know. And then this guy's actually going to advance. Nice. He's going an extra three inches. So That's nine, his movement. nine inches total. Nice. And he's going to go right there. Outside of one, I'm assuming. Yeah. No, sorry. We'll yeah, go like right. Uh, yeah, like right there. <laughs> I'm sure you can guess what I'm doing. Unfortunately. Yeah. So we'll put a little advance mm -hmm. token next to him. Uh, he's moved, he moved, he readied. This guy here is going to attempt to charge that guy. You can't overwatch because you retreated. Yep. Uh, I got a four, which will not do it, unfortunately. So but, I mean, that can come out there. Uh, he'll, he'll just move up this way a little bit. All right. So, um, and then this guy here, he is, I think, just going to move. Okay. So he's got an eight-inch movement. Nice. He's just going to move around the corner to there. All right, and I think that will do it for me. So um, you have initiative. Well, it's uh, go into the second Psychic. phase. Yep. Go to my phase. Yep, and you can. Uh, All right, so he's out of sight. So we'll do closest within twelve. Which actually, no, I don't even need to measure that. Yeah. So on a six, he takes a mortal wound. Yep. Nope. No. <laughs> All right, and same target. My goal was that you would just see. can't see him. Oh, you can't see him. Nope. Okay, well, he's just all over damn that. It. I messed that up then. <laughs> so on that, yeah, I should have looked when you when I knew what you were doing. That's okay. I just figured it was gonna be. Yeah, um, I, I guess I could have moved him this way, but 
That's okay. All right, so side bolt going into him right there. Yeah. Uh, need a five. Six. And and seven. Six. Seven. Yeah. All so right. So take my mortal wound. I'm out of wounds. So f you're n up. You're obscured because of the dude in front of me. Yeah. So five up. You are gone. No flesh wound. Nope. Yep. So. Um, I'll just take the black one off and yeah, replace red. it with the red. Right. So it means that taking concludes flesh wounds. my uh, psychic phase. Okay. On to shooting. All right. All right. Um, I believe I have the first ready guy. You do. Only one. Um, okay, right so there. we are gonna go. Well, they're both infiltrate. So, or they're both uh, cover. Yeah. Well, the guy right in front of me. <laughs> <laughs> so I mean, might as well. Yeah. All right. So do you get any other name? You have to be. Covered, right? Uh, I'm not I'm doing shot time anymore, so. Oh, okay. Yeah. You change it to reroll ones? Yep. Gotcha. All right, so on threes. Got two of them. Great. Let me get these two out so it's not confusing. Threes again. All right, here we go. Just right, one. One. Negative two. All right, looking for that six up. Bionix. Nope, Good. I rolled a two. All right. Uh, four up, you were gone. He is out of here. Pow. <laughs> One, one victory point for you. All right, that is him right there. Okay. I do believe I have at least one ready guy. Oh, yeah. The only one? Just the sniper. Oh, wow. And the only oh, guy you moved him back there. Okay. Is your rubric green that just shot. So. <laughs> yep. All right. So oh. we'll only get obscured, I think. Because you ignore the range, right? Yeah. Yeah. So it's just the minus one, which is a four for obscured. Yep. And I think... Do you, you have re-roll ones on them? Do you want to spend command points? Um, I'm not going to spend the command points. Okay. So, let's go ahead. Just hit on a four, re-rolling ones. That's a hit. Strength seven. Uh, so, looking threes. for a three. That's a six, which means you take a mortal wound in addition to your save uh, at AP minus two. All right. Well, let's see the save. Uh, so, AP minus two. Yep. You're five up in bowl, right? Uh, it would be a if it's a damage characteristic of one, it'll be a four. D three. Oh, D three. Okay, yeah. so negative two would put me five. Yep. Yep. So five up. No. No. Nope. So it's gonna be D three damage. So two. Alright. So then, plus your mortal wound. Yep. So which means I roll three of these dice. Yep. However, it's still gonna be five ups, and I just pick the highest. Roll. There's a five. There that will kill that Ruby Green. And give me a second victory point. All right. Uh, on so he's shot. I don't have any other ready models. Um, so it would just be the Soul Reaper cannon, I believe, because he fell back. Yep. Um, nothing's within six of him. So it would have to be at your leader. It will be, yes. All right, so four shots. You get the neg one for that. Let me check the range. I need 12 inches. Definitely within 12. Yep. Uh, so on four. Obscured. Yeah. All right. Not, not a single hit. That is not good. <laughs> it is not. All right. My so guys? if I spend the one command point to roll, I'd roll all four of those. No. So on your That's shooting, thought, it's yeah. just like your charge advance. Yeah. Like yeah. Right. One hit roll, one so, wound roll. On to your like shoot. That. Yeah. So let's go ahead and do this guy here. He's gonna try to take a pop shot off at that soul reaper. Uh, I can only see like the top half of him, so you're definitely obscured. Plus, I have a mortal wound, uh, okay. a flesh wound. So, that's going to be putting me... That? Soul Reaper? Yep. Uh, and... <laughs> you sure you didn't want to come with it? Let's see. I am oh, within sorry. 15. Oh, you're going for the flamer. Yeah. Oh, okay. sorry, the flamer. My bad. Yeah. Is that the right guy? Yeah. So, this guy right here. Yep. I can see the top half of him. So, I'm within 15, which means I get two shots, but I'm still minus two to hit. So, hitting on fives. No hits. Dude. All right, so he's shot. I've got this guy to shoot and this guy. Yep, and so we'll go, I am out of shooting. We'll go my leader. Okay. He's got five shots. Which is assuming going to shoot at the flamer? Yep. I just need to see if I'm within six. I don't know if I am. No, sir. So I'm going to be minus one to hit, minus two to hit. For a and uh, yeah. yeah. So hitting on five. We got okay. two hits. On fives again. On fives again for strength three. That is one wound. Damage characteristic of one, one and no so AP. So two up. All is dust. Yes. Is six. It You're is dust. There. And then this guy will shoot at the same person. Okay. Very obscured, but within half range. 
Uh, so, and a flesh wound, so hidden on fives. One hit, strength four, so I need fours. That's a six, so it's AP minus one, right, but still so one three damage. Up. Ooh, Ooh, I you might want to reroll that one now. <laughs> yeah. So I'm down to two. Okay. Yeah, right there it is. All right, so three up. Good to go. Yep, it makes it. Cool. And that's all machine. And that is mine. So. All right, so on to the... Combat phase. Combat. Yep. All right, Um, I will go with... Well, I'm going to go ahead and spend two command points and, and intervene first. and yep. fight first. So I will fight with this guy here against that guy right there. Okay. So I've got three attacks hidden on threes. I got two hits. Sorry. And I need fours. Mm -hmm. um, T4. Yep. Sixes are mortal wounds okay. in addition to the damage. No, f no mortal wounds, so just one, no AP safe. All right, five up. No. Fail. So on a four up, he will die. That's a four. Yep. yep. Takes that Zangler out and gives me a third victory point. Alright. Um, he will go into yep. him right there. Go with the flesh room. Uh, actually, no. We're going to go into the, the one that's free. I get okay. two attacks because my blades give me an extra one. Yep. So threes. One, one hit. I'm T3. On threes. So I'm straight four. That's a wound. Uh, AP? I don't think I might be just a negative one, but let me okay. double check. I have a four up armor save. Yeah, yeah, negative one. Yeah, four up armor save, six up invul, so I'll be a five up armor save with this guy. And I roll a cock to dice. <laughs> Got a four, so I'm gonna take a wound. Uh, not a not a flesh wound, sorry, a regular wound. Yep. All right, then uh, your attack go. Yep. So he's just he's not a combat specialist, so he's just got two attacks okay. with his transonic uh, blades. Hidden on, uh, he's got a flesh wound, so hidden on fours. One hit, wounding on fours. That is a two, so nothing. All right, on to the morale. Yep, I got three guys with flesh wounds now, but that's still not over half. How many models you got on the field? I've got seven. So you need to lose one more. I would or have to. Flesh I'd have to take more. a flesh wound on one more or lose a guy. <laughs> Yeah, because you only have one one missing. Yep. Right, However, how many rooms. models do you have on the field remaining? Seven. Oh, I have seven total, four yep. left. So if you lose one more, yep. you'll also have to take a break check. Yep. So, But I think that's The it. break check's at the end of the... End of the thing. Very yeah. end of the morale. So um, I have lost a guy, though, so a couple of my guys could... Um, could If I roll a six, yeah. will... Uh, be well, mainly I think only him, because he's still two inches. Yeah, so oh, just, just... It has to be un... Uncumbered, doesn't it? Well, he's he hasn't taken a flesh wound or anything, and it's, oh, okay. and it's That's not, a and it's uh, unshaken. unshaken. And none of my guys are gotcha. shaken. So, right. uh, this guy potentially could, and this guy potentially could. Mm -hmm. So, on a six for this guy, that's a three. He's good, and on a six for this guy, that's a five. Right. So he's good as well. Right. Now All I right. have no morale. So yeah, right. roll for uh, initiative for turn three. Yeah, <laughs> initiative for turn three. Set or six nine. You got it. This one finally. <laughs> All right, so these guys are obviously going to stay in combat. Um, this guy's going to move up to there. Okay, I'm going to move that out of the way. This guy's going to ready as normal. Okay. Um, this guy's actually going to move up to there. This guy is once again going to attempt to charge since you can't see me. Nope. I got double ones. So this is where I use one of my command points. <laughs> and uh, re-roll. Okay, a six. So I need to be running around. Yeah, definitely within seven. Okay. So he's going to come around to there. Okay, and then my leader, I think, is just going to move up to right there. And that'll be it for my movement. So okay. just the one ready model. Everybody else has moved or charged Right. And that react I had to do before you roll your charge, right? Correct. Yeah. yeah. Um, you you basically say I'm gonna overwatch or I'm gonna retreat. I would have made got you anyways, probably to be honest. But well, with only a six, you barely got in. Oh yeah. Mm. So, um, hmm. we are gonna fall back. While you're doing your movement, I'm gonna run back. Go for it. 
So that leaves everyone open there. So I can shoot you. Put me six inches closer to you, and you will be the closest target. You, I'm just going to ready. And you really have no choice but to stay in the fight, baby, buddy. All right, that is, I believe, what's left of my movement. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, so I fell back with the Zangor. Okay. And then he stayed in combat. I just nudged him up so he'd be in range of his flamer pistol. Sure. And then he just readied up. Okay. And I cool. believe that's all I got left, really. Yep. All right. So on to my phase. Psychic. All right. Well, we'll start with him and his uh, Icon of Flame into him yep. on a six. That is a six. Mortal so wound. So I take a mortal wound. All right. And then on to him, who's also the closest right there. Yep. On a five. That is cocked, but we got the three right there. Ooh, ooh. you finally failed it. You're going to re-roll? Yep. Uh, down to three. Once I find these dumb things. There it is. Oh, that's both of them. No. Does not go off. Okay. Wow, so finally. <laughs> yeah. All right, so on to shooting. Yep. Uh, so I have my only ready model. I don't know if he can see anybody be honest um he can't see anything <laughs> all right so, so he's done he shot into the air yeah warning shot yeah he was just shooting the wall to scare someone yeah <laughs> all, right, all right that's my so only ready model my ready guy will go soul reaper cannon into I'm make sure all of them are within range but i might go with just the one that's not obscured so we'll go into him is that a flesh wound uh, it is a flesh wound, my friend. All right. So with a shot, with guns that have more than one shot, what's the rule on splitting the fire? How close do you have to be? Uh, yeah. So it, you can split the fire into anybody within two. All right. Except that's not in, he's in combat. combat. Yeah. All right. So we are gonna split fire. Um, two shots and two shots. The one guy with flesh wound and then one guy with uh, the mortal wound. Okay. And your leader doesn't have anything, right? Nope. Okay. He is not taking any. Sorry. He. This is a. Uh, yeah, it's for him. There. Yeah. All right, so the two shots into the flesh wound, um, okay. just on threes. Yeah, no, 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 uh, no hiding, unfortunately, where I'm at. <laughs> I got two. Yeah, um, threes again. Yep. Two again. Negative three. Great. <laughs> All right, uh, so I need six ups. I made neither of them, so um, you're going to roll two dice, and you're going to add one to the rolls because I have a flesh wound. All right, so... We'll do the first one. That'll be a two. Yep. So that's the um, second flesh wound. You roll them at the same time. Oh, okay. Yeah. Two. Oh, all right. So I take so two more flesh wounds, wound and wound I still die. It. Yeah. All right. Uh, the second split fire shot into the other guy with the mortal wound. So threes. Two again. Great. Um, on threes again, because you're... Yep, T3. Just one. one. Okay. Six Negative up. three. I failed it. I will um, use my last... Uh, command point, my reroll for the turn. Didn't you reroll this turn? Mm-mm. -mm. No? Uh, well, not the phase. Down. It's the oh, phase. Oh, okay, for phase. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Gotcha. So, um, so but this will be my last command point. Looking okay. for a six. No, sir. Okay. All right. So, so that'll be your second wound. So on a five. Yep. Or four. No. no. So a flesh wound. He'll switch to a flesh wound. All right. And that is my readied guy. That'll give me another point. All right. Um, on to you got the initiative, so it'd be your shooting next. Yeah. Sorry. You're good. 
So I'm just checking my options. Uh, nope, just outside of range with him. Uh, my shooting next, you said? Yep. Okay. So we're going to go ahead and throw, I think, all of his shots into him. Oh. Yep. The bird. Yep. Into the bird. Uh, just going to be hitting on threes because I'm within half range and um, no flesh wounds or anything like that. So hitting on threes. All of them hit. Yay. <laughs> uh, I still need fives, though. <laughs> All right, Ooh. one. <laughs> <laughs> All right, five up in both. Come on. Yes. Ooh, get it. All right. All right. Let's see. Give me that four. No. That is a three. Damn it. <laughs> and I will follow suit with your hobby town thing. Um, yeah, I still want to use that bad. Oh, you don't have them in here. Oh, yeah, you do. You don't. No. Steal that here. One flesh wound. All right, and then it goes to my next shooting, which I do not have any. Is your guy is just outside of the range. I'll double check, yeah. Yeah, the only guy within range is him. And he's locked in combat. So, okay. back to you, if you have anything else. Um, yeah, I've got this guy here. So he'll try to take a shot off at your sniper since he's unobscured from him. Um, but I have a flesh wound, so I'm hitting on fours. Uh, two dice, sorry. Which, which guy? That Into guy right uh, him? No, right here. Oh, for the oh no, he's, he's, in combat. he's in combat, so it'll be obscured. But hitting on fives, and so okay. I still so got one hit, um, and then wounding on fours for strength four galvanic rifle. Dude. Nothing. All right, so and that's then, him. Didn't you have a? Oh, okay, that was him. That was that's pretty much well, it. Uh, this guy here, yeah. I mean, he can, can, yeah, he can definitely. Yeah, see he can see him. Maybe obscure. Yeah. Am I within I'd fifteen? Yeah. Yes, sir. So I've got two shots hitting on fives because I've got a flesh wound. Mm -hmm. uh, no hits. No. All right, and it would go to the combat. Uh, he has one wound on him. Okay. All right, so, um, apologize for that, trying to respond to my roommate. Um, <laughs> I think it's just me who charged yep. you right there. So I've got three attacks for my combat specialist. Uh, is he not the specialist then? No, he's a combat specialist too. I have two. Oh, then that one was not. Remember? Oh, he's, he's the guy dead. that's different. Okay, gotcha. Yeah, he's dead. So um, I've got that. three attacks hitting on threes, right? Because I haven't taken a flush wound. Okay, just a regular. Yeah, one. just a mortal one. Yeah, uh, all three hit. Okay. And now I'm looking for fours and sixes are an additional mortal wound. No, f no uh, additional mortal wounds. Just two regular attacks that are one damage each. No AP. So two up. Yeah, you get two up saves. You rolled a one. Ooh, uh, different phase, so yeah. I will burn it. I like that guy. And you rolled a one mm. again. <laughs> All right. Yes. So <laughs> that sucks. I was down three. Where's that? Was I at three or at two? You used. You would be down yeah, two, two. two. All right. So. All, All right. right. So. Come on. Damn it. <laughs> Flesh wound for you, I guess. So. All right. And then it's my attack back. Threes? Of course. Uh, threes. <laughs> again? Yep. No yeah. AP? Four up save. I fail it. <laughs> uh, four up? It's a six. Uh, that'll be my final wound on him. Oh, I've, that already was, uh, I've already taken a wound, so. Yeah, that was, I was rolling for Flesher. Oh, okay, so. Yeah, because you saved, and then you failed to save, so yeah. I was rolling the Flesher and I got a six. Oh, okay. So. He is dead then. Damn it. Um, can snow. Hmm. <laughs> no, I do not want to consolidate. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. So uh, consolidate and piling in rules pretty much the same thing. Yep. Exactly. You know how people can like uh, pile into something you didn't or you. Yep. Okay. You just have to end closer to the uh, the model that you charged. Yeah. Same rule. Okay. Yep. All right, that is the fight phase. Yeah. Okay. Uh, morale, unfortunately. Yeah. So now I've more than half my team currently has. Um, flesh wounds, or is, yeah. So, um, first thing I need to do is see if I'm broken. So my is entire... at the end of the game though. No, it's at the, end, the start of the morale phase. Oh, I could potentially break. Okay. So what I need to do is check the leadership on my highest leadership model, which is going to be my infiltrator precepts. Ah, yep. uh, you know where they are better yeah. than I would. Why can't this go right for me? 
<laughs> Leadership seven, great. Okay, Ooh. not as high as I would have liked. <laughs> um, all right, so I need to roll two d six and don't get higher than a seven, otherwise my kill team will be broken. All right, I rolled a five, so oh my, my kill team is not broken. That's good. However, I still have to take tests for the rest of these guys mm -hmm. to see if they're shaken. Uh, leadership six on this guy, and I've lost three, so I need to roll a three or under. He is shaken. Great. Okay. Um, I don't know if I... I'll just I put a retreat have... thing Yeah, that's to him. fine. All right, this guy, he is leadership six as well. He is also shaken. I believe I'm seven. Let me double check. And then that guy... Hey, he's shaken too. <laughs> uh, shaken this is not. Bacon. This is not good. We'll just put it that way. All right. Um, when most right, of my team so falls. on to me. Yep, your uh, morale. Uh, the rubric is seven. You've lost uh, six, five, four. So what? Four and under. Yep. Ooh, you got it. Yeah. Um, him, he's leadership six, so three and under. He will be good. Damn it. <laughs> and that is all me. Yep. Okay. All right. Not half my army is. Uh, Flesh wound song. I don't need to do the whole. Well, I guess that would be before that. Yeah. Yeah. You need to lose another model. I was hoping you would. <laughs> Ooh, that was close. All right. Um, on to turn four. Turn four. Potentially the final turn of the game. Uh, I don't know. Anything um, like last you've got time. three command points or three victory points, by the way, since you oh. killed another guy. We are tied on victory points right now. All right. Let's see so. who gets initiative for the last turn. Possibly last turn. Yeah. I roll four a five and a five, so that's nine. Yep. So that would be me. Yes, it would be. All right. Back up, <laughs> back up to four. All right. So we are going to... Not many guys left there. So you can go there. What can you see right there? Not anything. <laughs> he is just to hide from your sniper. Yeah. And so he's in range of those guys. Eight inches is just... Oh, no. In range of that. I don't know if you'd charge with him, though. Well, I can't do anything with him. He's shaken. Oh. <laughs> oh, shakens can't do anything this turn? Yeah. Really? Yeah. I need to read rules more. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty sure I can't do anything. Zeech just keeps whispering to me. I'm gonna. I'm, I'll double check. Yeah, double check uh, that. Yeah. That just seems weird. I mean, I guess if you're shaking, that makes sense. You're too scared to face yeah. Zeech. It's it's understandable. Um, My six. guys are afraid of the psychics. <laughs> they don't like birds. Birds and dust, man. <laughs> they just not doing minds them too me. much of Mars. Yeah. Um. All right. Let's see. But can I still shoot them? Yeah, you can shoot them. Oh, wow, that's... Yeah, don't the model that. is shaken and cannot do anything until it is no longer shaken. <laughs> so you have to take a broken test at, <laughs> at the end? Oh, yeah. and wow. And a shaken test again for each of them. Oh, wow, okay. Yeah. Ouch. Um, so it's pretty much just possibly you. <laughs> take out my leader and you'll win, pretty much. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to ready up. Mm. Nah, I'm going to move over. You got an eight inch move. Yep. But I have to be two inches to stay within there. Um, I will ready Soul Reaper because that seems to be doing good. Mm -hmm. um, the Psyker. We have to move you, buddy. How far up can you go? That's two inches. You got a six inch move, so it'd be two, two, and then two. Oh, I can't get to that objective. Uh, oh, luckily he's shook it. Yeah, but he can probably move. Although, mm -hmm. actually, he's not doing anything else. <laughs> yeah, <that's, laughs> I think I'm within sense. two, anyways. No. Do you have to be center or the edge? I really hate that wording. Yeah, I've I prefer the just edge. the edge. Yeah. yeah. So, it's. I think. But I've actually, had someone get me on that. I'm actually a little outside of two. Unfortunately. All right. Just do a little shuffle. That's all. Yep. All right. I so just can't shoot if I you. Do. <laughs> Um, well, you're tucked in. Let me see if you can actually fit past him. No. So I'm assuming that rule still applies. Yeah, so I'd have to go up, up over yeah. and then two inches that way. So I can only go that far. But I do kind of want to be closer to your leader. So he'll move the two inches up, two inches down, and then just right there. Sure. Um, and that is... Oh, I still got the bird guy. Mm-hmm. 
Um, what's the range for the charge? And you got a shotgun. So only five inches? That might possibly do it. He's got two or three ones. He's got two remaining. Can I still charge the shaking guys? Yeah. God, I just can't do anything. <laughs> Man, that is so harsh. Um, no, nah, I'm going to kind of stay there. Okay. All right, so that is my movement. Yeah, I only have four models. Okay. God, it's so weird only having four models. Yep. I'm going to charge him. Oh, <laughs> I will shoot you with nothing. And that, uh, I believe six will certainly do it. Get you in there. Within yeah, within inch. one. Yeah. So we'll go to there. Okay. And then that guy's actually going to ready up. Okay. Wherever my ready marker is. There we go. Okay. And that's all I can do. So, <laughs> psychic oh, phase. I forgot that again. Um, so, psychic phase. We are going to do Icon of Flame into him. Yeah. No. Great. You take a mortal wound yourself, right? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that would be tricky. All right. So, Cybolt into <laughs> the closest guy there. Yeah. So, five. Seven. This is, this is close to All right. Yep. So, so I'm already taking a there. flesh wound. So four up. Yes. Nope, another flesh wound. Two flesh wounds. And that is my psychic. Okay. So shooting. Yep. I got the initiative. So ready up would be me. Mm -hmm. Um. Damn. I wanted that later. Never. <laughs> What's uh, the range for split fire again? Two inches. Yep. I don't. Definitely think not. No. Nope. You got to throw all of them into him. Uh. Yep. All four. Well, you will get obscured, so on fours. That is caught. So three of them uh, on threes. <laughs> Just one, negative three. I could make, I could make this. Yep, so, <laughs> so let's see it. Now I'm a sire blesses. Yes, yes it is. <laughs> he has blessed me. All right, and then that is my only readied guy. My only ready guy is going to shoot your flamer. Yep. <laughs> I'll just get the neg one for obscured. That's it. No, uh, no, yeah, I don't no. think you're obscured either. <laughs> no. Yeah. Okay. So I'm just hitting you on threes. You're rolling ones. That's a six. Mm -hmm. Wounding you on threes. That is also a six. So that's a mortal wound plus a save at AP minus two D three damage. All right. So five up. Nope. Go ahead. Uh, did you make it? Nope. Okay. So D three damage. It's gonna be two plus the mortal. So I'm looking for three mm -hmm. on four ups. See, has he taken a more, uh, flesh wound? Oh, yeah. Yeah, so uh, three ups then. Yeah. He is out of here. All right. Yes. <laughs> All right, it's four victory points. And that's my only shooting. So. All right, so six inches. That's him. Yep. Yeah. So we will do D6 shots. Five. Mm -hmm. This will probably kill me now. But winning me on fours. <laughs> yeah, three to three. Fours. Only one. One, negative two. I could make it. I made it. <laughs> All right, that is my shooting. Okay, um, my charge. All right, we'll spend the two command points to fight first. Sure. So on two. So on threes. Get them both. Yeah. Um, is it hit rolls for death to the false emperor? Oh, I don't it think is I have it on him. Yeah, but you don't have no, it on Zayn. Not on him. It's, so. uh, it's yeah. the rubrics. Yeah, so threes to wound me. Yep. Get them both. Okay. Neg one. Yeah, five up saves. I fail both. I will now use one of my command points to reroll one of these. Okay. I still fail it, so go ahead and make your damage. You're... So four up, you are gone. You're gone. Why? <laughs> <laughs> well spent two command points. Yep. All right, that is five phase. Um, on to morale. You got a priority though here. So, uh, what's the rule for breaking? Uh, so it's only if I have flesh wounds, though, right? If half your models are out of action or have flesh wounds, okay. yeah, and you are definitely at that. So I got to roll a eight, not above eight, on right. two dice. I'm good. That's a five. Yep. Okay. I now have to do the same thing. My highest leadership now is unfortunately only six. So, <laughs> Ooh. average roll. And roll you got the high. average roll. And I am uh, broken at this point. Now I do believe in the victory conditions. Um, if the other, if the other person's kill team is broken, you oh, win. I got the four. So let's see. Sweep and clear. If at the bet the battle ends because there's only one unbroken kill team on the battlefield, that player's kill team 
Uh, the kill team's player wins. Otherwise, each player scores three. Yeah, so you have won this mission. Well, Again. Different mission. Yeah, but good game. I think I did better this game. That, it was a lot <laughs> yeah. scary, I will not lie. Those Rust Stalkers yeah, this, do some I, work. This is certainly a better kill team, I think, for the format. Yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm definitely a lot happier with this. So. I would definitely keep those guys, but also keep the other ones in the big 20-man roster, you know what I mean? Yeah. That way you can mm -hmm. swap them out. Because, like, the, that setup for Take Prisoners yeah. would yeah. have been a whole different game. <laughs> yeah. Like, I would have been winning by a lot. And because that, that, that match doesn't end when people are broken. Yeah. So. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. No, we'd still be going. <laughs> yeah. But, good game. Yeah. Um, yeah. So, you'll win again. So, I get to go ahead and make some casualty games. rolls and stuff. So... Um, let's go ahead and start with uh, the guys that have flesh runes, which is almost everyone. So on a three or under, they're fine. Or on a four or higher, is that what it is? Page. Uh, it's the very end. Ah, it's yeah. the uh, casualty thing. I can't remember if I need to roll low or high on this. Um, casualty roll. On the one to three, that model recovers. On a four okay. to six, I've got a out of action. Casualty. Yeah, they're out of action. Okay. All right, so this guy's out of action. Um... He's taken two. But I don't he's think actually that good. Yeah. The one guy that might be good. Yeah, he's yeah. my sniper's good, yeah. and then this guy here, he's out of action as well. All right. So my Crap. only guy with the flesh wound is him. Yeah. So I gotta do the same thing. So I need what a three and under. Yep. Got good. It. Yeah. So he's gonna make a full He'll recovery. Come join the rest. Yeah. Of those. And then we'll we'll go ahead. And we're gonna do all of our uh, uh, other stuff basically off camera. So um, we'll go ahead and film a, a little recap now. All right, guys, so uh, another campaign game done. I know it was the same uh, factions again, but it certainly played out a lot differently, um, aside from the fact that I still lost because I, I apparently still suck at this game. Our uh, score is just tied. Four yeah, four. We, we actually had the same amount of victory points, four to four at the end of the game, but my kill team broke. Um, and in this particular mission, it says if, uh, uh, if there's only one unbroken kill team, that kill team wins. Is the victor. So... Um, so he did go ahead and win because my kill team broke because he made his leadership test and I failed because we were both at that breaking point to be honest. Zeke protects. Yep, um, and the Void Dragon did not. So, <laughs> um, sadly. So, what do you think about the second game? You got the rules down a lot better. Uh, yeah, the rules were a little bit easier to pick up uh, for my second time around. I did a little bit of studying, of course, but yep. um, yeah, other than that, like your, this was a little scary melee. Yeah, I, I like. That. I liked this kill team a lot better uh, with the rest stalkers and and the still the same leader, the infiltrated mm -hmm. princess. They killed a lot of things. Oh, the um, mortal wounds on sixes. Were, yeah, yeah, yeah. They, they killed I think two or three guys just with that. Yeah. Um, the sniper did his job. He killed two guys. So, and then yeah, the rest of the game. <laughs> yeah, uh, unfortunately, it's then three high. of my models uh, failed their break tests and became shaken and could not do anything. So that, that was. That's serious. That really messed yeah. up my game because uh, that, that... That just gives me free reign. Yeah, it gave him free reign the last turn yeah. of the game. So um, that's how I lost, essentially. But you'll see that. Um, anyways, uh, I'm pretty happy with it. I had a lot of fun this game. Mm -hmm. I liked switching up the terrain a little bit different. So um, hopefully the next game we'll get two different armies in. Yeah, I can so, bring some Chaos or some Yeah, Dark I'd like to see the Chaos. And you said your roommate's going to bring Dark yeah, Eldar. Dark Eldar or yeah. Harlequin. Hopefully some Harlequin. Yeah, so that'll hopefully Maybe be... Maybe not, I don't know. Yeah. Harlequin sounds scary. Yeah, hopefully that'll be our next game. Uh, but until then, we'll see you guys later. Thanks. Yeah, Bye. Thanks.